I'm Kendall and this is my shopping haul video. So basically today I've just been shopping all day at Blue Water which is a shopping centre and yeah I'm just going to basically be showing you what I've got. The budget was £200, I think I might have gone a little bit over but I'm going to show you everything I got, all the prices of, of everything. I actually got so much for my money because of I didn't go for the proper designer stuff um, because I went for like the more like the best things that I liked, the best quality stuff, but the things that looked really nice too. But anyway, I'm gonna show you it all, and yeah, that's really it. I don't want to make the intro any longer. I'm just gonna go and show it. But if you enjoy the video, please like it and subscribe. That's all I really want to say. And yeah, so let's go. So first of all, I think I'm gonna start with the smallest thing I bought, and it was actually the last shop we went in. It's actually probably one of my favourite things I bought because I bought mainly clothes but as you can see this is a Too Faced bag so this is not clothes. This is the first time I've ever been to the Too Faced shop because Blue Water isn't actually our closest shop in. Hall we actually go lakeside most of the time but we like because we have to cross the bridge to get to Blue Water but it's nice to go there because it's quite more high end shops so yeah I've never been to just a Too Faced store before and my parents have and they once bought me did they buy me? oh they bought me a little mini peach palette which is so cute but today I got to go to myself and it is the cutest store I was actually vlogging a little bit because I was thinking about doing a vlog instead but as I got so much stuff I thought I'd show you it all so I may add some clips maybe at the end of the vlog that I did but I'll put the videos of what the store looked like for Too Faced. It was the cutest shop ever and it was so like girly and sparkly. It was so cute but you can see that at the end anyway. But the shop's like really good for smaller versions so like the travel size stuff. So I have bought myself a small concealer. I just wanted to try the concealer but obviously it's quite expensive so if it doesn't really work with all your other makeup stuff you've got then you just spent a lot of money on something that doesn't work so this is £10 for the small one they only had it in three shades so they have it in snow I think I'm really light pale skins so I would probably go for the lightest which is swan but the lightest they had is snow but that's only one up so the lightest they had was snow but it's only one up from the lightest one so yeah that was all I got from Too Faced because as I said I'm going to Florida soon so I'll be getting a lot of makeup out there so watch out for that makeup haul or the American haul. So that was Too Faced and now we're going to move on to the clothes. So I did actually go into Victoria's Secret but I only got myself some bras and they're just quite simple ones and just plain ones so I don't think you really want to see them but I thought I'd just let you know I did spend some money in there. So yeah, that's that. Where to next? I think we'll go H&M because of, I got quite a lot of stuff in there on sale, which is really good. So, I'll tell you the original price and the price I bought it for. So you can see if you'd like to buy anything, then you know what the price is normally. So yeah. Okay, so I'm just gonna work my way down the bag. I've took it all out to show my sister and I just put it all back in so we're just going to pull stuff out at random so yeah so these I love so much literally like, this is one of my favourite things and these are shorts I've gone for very similar style of things so these are shorts and also, as it's Florida it's going to be really hot so I've gone for very summery clothes but I love this short so much it's got a little belt and I don't know, I just think they're really cute. So I didn't buy this in the sale but it was quite a good price anyway. It was £12.99. To go with it, it's kind of like a brownie colour leaf. I got a little popper up bodysuit. That has got like the neck thing which may be a little bit hot but obviously it's got the inner arms and then it does up underneath. Like this is them together so 
the colours match really well, I think. So yeah, I've got that. And I have actually bought a top from Hollister, which I will, which matches with this as well, which I'll show you after. So if I keep the shorts out, then you'll be able to see it with that. But yeah, so I just got that. This was 9 99 which wasn't on a sale as well. The £10 for this. What's next in the van? Okay, I've seen this and I love these. So these, I feel like snake print's really in at the moment. And they're just some, they're just shorts. And yeah, they've got pockets and I'm obsessed with pockets. And I don't know why, they're just so handy. And yeah, I just think they look really nice on as well. And these were supposed to be 8 99 but they were reduced to six pounds, so that's quite good. Six, I mean, six pounds for these is amazing, right? I think so. So yeah. Okay, I feel like now I'm going through it all. I'm like, this is my favorite. No, this is my favorite. But I also really love this. This is something that I really want to wear in Animal Kingdom because obviously it's animal print. But this is a playset. It's such nice material and it does actually need to be like hitched up a bit because of the really long straps. And this one was supposed to be £12.99 but was reduced to £6. So once again that's really really good. So staying on the play suit theme, I also got this. Is that right way? Yeah. So obviously it's black with pink roses on which is really cute with the shorts again. And yeah, basically the same style. And this was £12.99, so it was, this one wasn't reduced. But yeah, I paid £12.99 for this, which I still think is really good. So that's it for H&M, I believe, unless I've put anything accidentally in any other bags. But yeah, so that's it for H&M. So next we're going to go on to my Primark stuff, which I'm really excited about. I feel like I've got some really cute things in there and obviously Primark's really good for pricing. So this, as you can see, is a mustard colour and it's also a play suit with the shorts but I really struggled finding things like this actually with the shorts. I literally bought every play suit I saw and this was £13 which is obviously really good for a play suit. Okay. Are you ready for this? This is like so sparkly. So, here it is. Literally, I know what you're thinking. When am I going to wear this? And to be honest, I don't know. Like, it's so sparkly. It's like shining off the camera. But this is also a play suit. I feel like I've said play suit so many times in this video. But this is also a play suit. So, this is so sparkly and I love it. I think it's supposed to be for the beach because of there was also a bikini that matched it but I just really like it and it was supposed to be £12 but it was reduced to £5 so I just wanted it anyway because it's so sparkly and yeah I also bought some more bras from Primark as well which once again they're quite plain so I don't think you want to see them so the last one from Primark is actually an accessory yeah, there we go I got some sunglasses because of obviously when you're at water parks and stuff you don't want to take some expensive sunglasses because last year I went to California and my mum went swimming in the sea with her Tiffany sunglasses on and a wave come and just took them off her head and yeah she never found them again so we kind of learnt from that do not take your sunglasses in the sea if they're expensive because my dad was like oh it's fine until we realised it was Tiffany. He was like, we'll just get some new ones. Yeah, then he realised it was Tiffany. But she did actually end up getting two more pairs of Tiffany. I don't know how. But yeah, so that happened. These are £3, so obviously it doesn't matter if they get lost. But this is what they look like. So these are them. I don't know if they suit me or not. But Long just kind of saw them was like, these are nice ones. I was like, yeah, why not? I put them on, but the colour is really weird. Like the sky right now is like yellow and brown. I think I think I like them. I like the shape of them anyway. And yeah, like I said, they're really good for just like if I go to the water park and I have to wear these instead. 
of like my mouse ones that I'd be like really upset if I lost them. So yeah, these are them. So the next thing is from Topshop. I only bought one thing from there, but everywhere I went, I kept on seeing this pattern. So I I was gonna go get it from Jack Wheels because at first I looked at them and then I thought I'd go back to it, but then I decided to go for this one instead. So this is the pattern. It's literally everywhere. There's a habit in jumpsuits, play suits. Funny enough, I didn't actually go for a play suit this time, but they have like, they had loads of different ones. They had ones with open backs, not open backs. They literally had everything in this pattern. But I went for something like a little different. So uh, my style is obviously like play suits and jumpsuits. This is kind of like a jumpsuit, but kind of like dungarees at the same time. So this is the back of it. So as you can see, it's like a dungaree kind of style. And then at the front is just like that. This was the most expensive thing I bought. Um, it, it was originally supposed to be £55. I would not pay £55 for that. $100. $100! I spent like 20 something pounds on it. I'll put the price, exact price down here because I can't quite remember. I need to go get the receipts. I thought everything I was going to be buying today was going to be 40 plus, like every separate item. So I think that's really good because I feel like I'm wanting designer stuff and then realised I just really wanted like all the designs I loved weren't actually that expensive. So yeah, except from we did go in Tommy Hilfiger and I saw this lovely like jumpsuit, obviously, but with like a tie and haunt neck but that was it's in the sale and it was 200 pounds i think so that was like my whole budget so i didn't get that because obviously i didn't get that because i need loads of clothes but yes yeah. so that's what i bought in top shop so the last bag we're gonna go through is from hollister so the there was a sale and there was also a free for two on the sale items that ended in 99p. So we didn't actually know that when we was buying it. And then at the counter, he was like, "You did you know about the deal? I was like, no. But luckily, I don't, literally don't know how we did it. We had three items, exactly three items. So obviously we ended up then getting one for free, which is perfect. So I'm just going to go through the bag again. From the order I see it in. So this one is a leopard print top which I thought again would be good for Animal Kingdom in Florida. Okay so this one was supposed to be $10.99 and oh no hang on that's another reduced sticker. I can't see what it says underneath but there's a price underneath and the sticker at the top saying $10.99 and we actually got it for Four ninety nine, and actually this is the one we that was in the deal as well and I bought my sister one of these but yeah so I just thought it's really cute so I'm gonna pair these with some white shorts which I think will look really cute or even black shorts so yeah this is the other top that I said to go with the other shorts so this is the top that I said would match these shorts because the same kind of colour but it's just not a popper wrapper so it's not like a it's not a bodysuit so this is a bit different so this one was supposed to be 14 pounds okay so this was supposed to be 14 pounds but it had 40 percent off so it ended up being five pounds 60 so yeah that's just another little top that went with this one and then i also with the same jumpsuit of the pattern that i saw everywhere it's not the exact same, but it's very similar. This one's just really cute. It's so, it's the shorts again. And then this does up at the front to make it high and lower. It's quite a low cut, but the, obviously the tighter you do it, the higher it will come up. So this one was supposed to be £39 and was actually... £11.70 so down from £39 to £11.70 which I think is really good for this and it looks really nice on as well so yeah that's the one so these are the last items so these are the last items that I've got to show you 
and they're the same thing but just in different colours. So the blue colour I saw in another piece of clothing it was like a knitted style but obviously it was going to be too hot for the summer so when I saw this I really wanted it and basically it's kind of like a one of those tube tops but it goes up at the neck so you can tie it round here if that makes sense I think it's really cute it, it comes up quite high so it's a high cut top and yeah I think it's really cute I got the one in blue because I really like the idea with having it with white shorts and I have some white shorts which are kind of like a bit of like a lace kind of feel to it so I thought they would match really well and then when I saw the yellow one I really love this colour I know quite a lot of people don't like it but I kind of like the mustardy colour which I think is really nice especially with like the blue jean colour so I'll be wearing my blue jean shorts with this one and yes the same thing ties up there and yeah they're supposed to be 17 pounds and ended up being six pound 80 these are six pound 80 each but they're sort of supposed to be 17 pounds each so that's really good so in honestar i spent a total of 94 pound 48p for all of that which is really good so yeah i'm really happy with it all so yeah i actually do have one more thing which i forgot i had so i have one more thing to show you and this is a swimming costume so this is a swimming costume so this is the back of it and then this is the front it's quite a low cut but i'm so i might stitch it depending on how far it comes on because i didn't actually try this on i just really liked it and yeah this is from monsoon and i love the gold in it so it's blue and white and i love the gold in it and I just think it's really, really pretty. Definitely my style. I love that it's got the open back. And yeah, I just think it's really nice. And this one was supposed to be £39. And we paid £19.50 for it. So I just really love this so much. I just think it's really pretty. So... All my other ones are kind of, my other swimming costumes are kind of for the beach. So this is, I'm definitely going to be wearing to the water parks. So yeah. So thank you so much for watching my haul. This is everything that I got. I really hope you enjoyed it. And yeah, that's all I really have to say. If you did enjoy it, then please do like it and subscribe. I'm sorry if the light did fade in this video. I just really wanted to get it videoed so I could upload it straight away. So thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye. If we don't this whole thing up, guaranteed I can blow your mind. And tonight I'm alive in a dollar sign. Guaranteed I can blow your mind. And tonight I'm alive in a dollar sign. Guaranteed I can blow your mind. What?